everybody welcome back to another vlog today is sunday the day i'm filming this we're gonna do a little sunday fun day with our friends noel and josh we haven't seen them in forever we've all been so busy so it'll be nice to get together and plan some japan stuff because we are going to japan with them in like a month and a half that's crazy so it's gonna be really fun i just got myself dressed we actually i believe are all gonna be matching with our shoes today because <laughs> drew ended up getting a pair of like nike blazers i think they're called and josh already had some and then he got some for noel they would always kind of wear them at the same time and I would joke like I want to be part of the club and so for my birthday Drew got me some so here's my outfit of the day don't mind the sound of the laundry so I have this little split cardigan this is from ASOS I believe sorry ASOS I've been saying that incorrectly for a long time and then these jeans are from good American these are the good 90s jeans they're the best jeans in the world these are the blazers how freaking cute are these I got the platform pink version um freaking adorable I did a little bang braids moment and that is simply because my hair is greasy <laughs> oh our friends are here so let's go to brunch blazer gang look at us our powers supposed to have a brow microblading appointment today but about a week ago I canceled it because I've just heard a lot of like mixed opinions about it and so I'm just gonna in the meantime oh I need to get gas too in the meantime I'm just gonna keep doing like lamination and tinting which is what I'm doing today and I did lose my deposit which sucks because uh, it was completely non-refundable no matter when you canceled it but it's okay it's fine <laughs> I'm a little salty about it, but. Our Sunday fun day was so much fun. We had such a blast and we were literally home by like 3 p.m. I 
think. And like we made a pizza, we sat on the couch, we watched the Grammys. It was like a nice way to end the weekend. It's just fun to like have those times where you just kind of cut loose and hang out with your friends and enjoy the beautiful weather. And like, yeah, that's one of the reasons why I moved here, you know, was to have days like that. So it was a great day. And now it's back to reality. So I've been working all morning. It's about noon right now. And I am headed to this brow place, which is also right across the street from an air one, which is like a very fancy kind of like overhyped bougie grocery store here in LA. They have a lot of like local stuff. They have a lot of like healthy stuff, but their hot bar is really freaking good. Really, really good. Even though it is very expensive. I love their breakfast burritos. I love their buffalo cauliflower. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I love the white bean kale salad. Love their Korean short ribs. Like there's just a lot of things that are really, really good. And it's like right across the street and I am kind of hungry. So I may stop by and get some of that. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling after my appointment. It usually only takes about like 30, 40, five minutes the girl who does my brows is so fast it's insane i love it and yeah i'm just in the meantime i'm snacking on this sleeve of ritz crackers um why is it that you can eat like a half a sleeve of ritz crackers and feel like you've eaten nothing there's like no sustenance in them whatsoever but i was just craving them so anyways i'm gonna go get these brows done up because they're very sparse i have naturally like super light eyebrows um so i just really need to get them touched up shaped up I'll be a new woman when I leave. It's like one of my little things that I'm doing to treat myself. So let's do it. Let's get these brows done and go on with our day. Start off the week right. back in the car my face is red because i had my mask on but i only ended up just getting a smoothie at air one because literally i just had groceries delivered this morning like i can go home and make lunch and they didn't have the korean short ribs that i wanted so anyways okay we're gonna try this smoothie i decided to get a pattaya smoothie i was gonna get the bella hadid one but i feel like there's just a bunch of shit in it that like i'm like i don't know what that is <laughs> i don't know if i want to try it my body is really weird i mean obviously being an ibs girly um there's just a lot of stuff that i'm not willing to try for the first First time when I have stuff to do. So anyways, okay. I'm gonna try this Pattaya smoothie. It was $13, so not as expensive as the $20 like Hailey Bieber, Bella Hadid smoothies, but here we go. We are gonna taste test it. Let's see how it is. That's actually delicious. I'm like worried it's gonna stain my mouth and my teeth, but whatever. It is very vibrant in person. It's beautiful. Mm. I mean, it kind of tastes like a pitaya bowl minus like the toppings. I mean, it's pretty much the same thing, but it's delicious. And I was just in the mood for something like fruity and cold and refreshing because I'm actually kind of warm right now with what I'm wearing. So anyways, I'm going to go do my least favorite task in the entire world, which is get gas. I don't know why I hate getting gas so much. I would literally rather do anything, but uh, if that's the worst thing I have to do today, then I'm okay with that. So, okay. Going to enjoy my smoothie, get some gas, and then we're going to head home. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's actually now the next day. I have since washed off my brow. So here is what they're looking like 24 hours later. And yes, I did take off my lash extension thingies. Um, They were bothering me and one of them was wonky. So I'm going to redo them later. I am uh, currently making some lunch. I'm making like a little spicy chicken sandwich and fries because that sounded really good. And then I'm going to go out and do like maybe an hour walk because balance. Am I right? So here's what we've got going on for lunch. You're eating all my fries. No. <laughs> okay, so I did one of these chicken patties here. I'll show you. These are the just bare, lightly breaded, spicy chicken fillets. I haven't tried one yet, but Drew said they're pretty good. And then we've also got some zesty straight curly fries, but they're straight. I don't know. When Drew unboxed this with the groceries, it said zesty straight, and he goes, me. <laughs> so I'm going to do like kind of like a McDonald's, like spicy McChicken. It's like a hamburger bun, a little bit of mayonnaise. I'm not a huge mayo gal. 
don't come for me. Usually I try to do some sort of like salad for lunch because it's just like a good way for me to get some nutrients in. But I'm just not in the mood for that today. I really wanted this. So we're gonna do a little bit of shredded lettuce and then the patty. And that's it. Then I air fried some fries along with that and it seems like they're uh, a little overdone, but that's okay. Baby. <laughs> and would you look at that? Gorgeous balanced meal. Let's taste test it together. Can you grab me some ranch? Not bad, honestly. Mmm, it is spicy. Why is it spicy? <laughs> it needs a little ranch. I'm a ranch girly in moderation, like for dipping, chicken sandwiches, things like that. But I could never do ranch on a salad. Unpopular opinion. Throwback to when I was in England and they had an American style salad at the grocery store. Oh, and it was a salad with ranch and like bacon bits. I was like, wow, representation. Oh, and how could I forget the most important part? You guys, I caved. I bought another 12 pack. I don't want to talk about it. I've had one spicy water since then. Besides like if you count Olipop. <sighs> it's so good. It brings me joy, okay? If you're also trash like me, I see you. I'm one with you. All right, just took Layla outside again and I'm gonna take myself out on a walk, but I have had these clean clothes sitting on our kitchen island because it's like right by where our washer and dryer are for like the last two days, three days possibly. So I'm gonna put these away first and um, just thought, you know, if anyone wanted to feel a little bit more seen, yeah. I just left my clothes sitting here for like two, three days and I walked past them 200 times. But I just couldn't be bothered until now, you know? And um, maybe if you needed some gentle encouragement to put your own laundry away, here you go. The crows were eat with me. We're gonna do this. It's gonna feel so much better, but I hate doing it. I don't know if it's even like visible from this angle, but this is how dark our bedroom is in the brightest part of the day. It's actually kind of depressing. <laughs> and that's like one thing that, you know, there are pros and cons to every place to live, but that is one thing that really is driving me bonkers about the place that I live right now. What is that? Oh, that's what I heard earlier and I was like, what the hell? I don't know. <laughs> Our ice machine is on the fritz. Good thing there's a warranty. That sounds horrible. Hold please, we're having an emergency. Okay, that was an eventful um, side conquest there. A little bump in the road, but yeah, now we're gonna have to like, I think send our ice machine back and we've only had it for like less than a month. Ugh, I think we got a dud, we got a lemon. Anyways, whatever. I'm just gonna finish putting away my laundry. I'm late now for my walk and I'm gonna run into like afternoon traffic. So I'm just gonna try to do my best to get out as soon as possible to avoid that. Not gonna lie, we didn't put it all away, but you know, we made progress. It's fine. Let's go walking. Actually, before I go do that, I forgot that I ordered this package. And listen, I don't know what I was thinking, okay? I'm just going for it. But I have been contemplating getting bangs lately, and I probably won't. Also, we're not gonna talk about how greasy my hair is. I probably won't do it. And the reason that I bought myself clip-on bangs was so I could convince myself to not, because I know that they're not gonna look good on me. So, okay. <laughs> I just got these on Amazon, and um, we're gonna see what they look like. I don't think these are the right color. We'll work with it. It also comes with a roller. Okay, fancy. I'm not exactly sure why. Um, and these are supposed to be wispy. <laughs> now that I'm like doing this, I'm like, this was stupid. This was a dumb idea. Oh, so you like clip it up. Okay, probably like should be fully ready before I do this. Like have some makeup on, have my hair styled, but whatever, okay. Let's try it out. Oh. <gasps> um, 
actually these aren't too dark but they just look really really fake um <laughs> first of all it being in my eyes is already driving me nuts oh i think it would i think it would be a sensory nightmare for me oh god it's all in my eyes no 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 okay you know it was a fun experiment it doesn't like look too bad from far away but it actually is like physically poking me in my eye how do people with bangs do this do you just have hair in your face all the time or do you just have them shorter because like this is how i would want them to look it is giving michelle duggar a little bit which is mildly concerning to me but honestly it's not as bad as i thought let me like try putting my hair up and see i mean I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. It's obviously so super fake. I would maybe wear these for like a photo or something, but no. Eh. So I think it's gonna be a no, but it was a cute idea. I've just been like in such a rut with my hair lately and trying to figure out like how to style it, what I want to do with it. I've been styling my hair exactly the same since literally like I was in 10th grade, just like apart curls and that's it. I don't know there's like not much else. So I thought oh what if we spice it up with some bangs but um yeah I don't think these are it. This is hilarious though. Probably not in the cards for me anytime soon. <laughs> okay I don't really have much time left because I have lollygagged and pushed this off for too long and basically like my neighborhood starts getting really really busy come like 3 30 ish. Um just like a lot of stuff. Everyone's out and about so I want to try and avoid that if possible. I'm gonna try to get out there and maybe walk for like 30 minutes now. I was gonna go for like an hour but I'll probably just do like 30 minutes. Just a little something. Then I'm gonna do like an everything shower when I get at home i'm gonna wash my hair i'm gonna shave i'm gonna do all the things and then we are gonna watch love island tonight and i have been so freaking hooked on love island you guys oh my gosh i'm not current on love island because we are watching it here in the u.s um just like as it comes on hulu so instead of like people in the uk who are two weeks ahead we are about to face i think like one of the first eliminations tonight besides david who went home in the like he was the bombshell who went home hello this is crooked but I think this will be like the first guy and girl that'll go home. Um, so it's gonna be crazy. I think I already know who it is. It's kind of hard to avoid spoilers if you're like a couple weeks behind in a show, but we are just loving it so much. And it actually is fun watching a new episode every night, having another one to look forward to the next day. So it's gonna be fun. I've had such a great few days in this vlog. I've had so much fun like hanging out with my friends, going out and about, getting some drinks, doing some self care stuff, getting my brows done. But thank you so much for being here. Thank you for spending your time with me thank you for watching let me know your thoughts on the bangs situation down below as well because it's pretty bad and like besties i will not be offended if you tell me it's bad um because it's not real it's clipping so don't hold back and yeah i will see you very soon in my next vlog bye